Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a quick drugstore haul for you. Everything I've purchased, I purchased from Walgreens. First, we're going to start off with this beauty blender. It is dirty because I did use it today. It was only $2. It is very, very soft. They do have um, another brand, um, generic beauty blender at Walgreens that costs more. But it is a lot harder than this one. This one is very, very soft, as you can see. So I was very, very pleased with it. And like I said, it's only $2. I also picked up the Wet n Wild um, High Flying Colors, the Limited Edition Palette. Um, in another haul video, you'll see that I was able to find two palettes. And the Walgreens I went to did not have this palette. So today, I found this at a different Walgreens. So let me just give you a swatch of those colors. And as you can see, I did use this palette for the makeup look that I'm wearing today. And there is a tutorial on this look. But I will go ahead and give you a quick swatch of these colors. It is a very, very pretty palette. We'll start off with the blue. There's that pretty blue in there. Next we have a lighter shimmery blue. And there's that there. As you can see, these colors are very, very vibrant. And this palette, it was $5.29. The other two palettes that I purchased, the Walgreens that I went to, they were only $4.99. So, I don't know what's up with that. And there's that blue there. It's kind of a little shimmery, kind of like a sky blue. Next we have a grayish looking color. Grayish, silvery. Ooh, ooh. And I just dug my nail in there. I am good for digging my nail and stuff. Just a second here. I swatched it, but I got some blue in there. We're going to try that again. Ooh. And like I said, this is a kind of a silvery color. It's that there. Next we have a soft baby pink. And these are very soft. I like um, this palette better than the other two. The other two were a little more chalky, and this one is just really, really soft. And here's a hot pink that's in that palette. There's that. Get a better swatch of that. And like I said, I like this one better. I mean, the colors are a little bit powdery, but as you can see, they're really pigmented. They are really soft. The other two, they weren't as soft as this one, so I'm pleased with that. Next, we have a shimmery purple. Kind of like an amethyst. And there's that there. And the last one is a deeper purple. Uh -oh. And I keep grabbing too much. And there that is. It's kind of picking up. Not a true purple, but it is a true purple. And like I said, it was $5.29 for some reason. Like I said, the other two, they were only $4.99. But I do like this palette better. This is the Wet n Wild High Flying Colors. Next, I picked up the Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. I've been seeing a lot of good stuff about this, so I thought I would try it out. It was like $6.99. Also from Walgreens. Um, I would say it's pretty much like any other um, primer for your skin. I would even compare it to the Smashbox. It has the same consistency. I don't know about the same staying power. I have super oily skin and primers just don't work that well for me. But I did use this today. 
I also picked up the Airspun Loose Face Powder. This is in Translucent Extra Coverage. Now, I've seen some drag queens using this on their face, and they love it. And I've seen a couple of other YouTubers that have done a review on this that they liked it. So I thought I would give it a try. I did use it today. I do think that it kind of gave off a white cast a little bit at first. Um, so you need to make sure you spray your face with um, some Fix Plus or something like that. So you're not kind of cakey. And just make sure your, your face kind of warms up. Um, so it doesn't look kind of give you a white cast. But... I like it. A lot of people, you know, have either a love-hate relationship because it does have a scent. It does have that old grandma-type perfumey smell. But it was okay. I did try it out. We'll see how it goes. I also picked up the Revlon Color Stay um, Foundation. This is in the combination oily because I am extremely oily. And I picked it up in the color Caramel. Now, I've used this before, but I haven't used it in years. It was on sale for 40% off, so it was only like $8.99 today. And it was either this that was a tad too light, or when I put it with the Airspun, that just gave it kind of a slightly pale look, so I had to really bronze up my face a bit. But this is what I've been wearing all day, and it's holding up really well. As you can see, it looks really good. Like I said, I do have a tutorial on this look. And I was also able to pick up the Milani Adore Matte Lip Cream. I only picked up three of them because that's all I need. I don't need the whole collection. I don't need to be buying anything I don't need. They are only $6.99. I picked up the colors Adore, which is what I'm wearing on my lips today. It's just a nice neutral color and I, I really really like it. I also picked up Embrace which I have not worn yet. It looks like kind of like a pinky purple and I picked up Lust which should look like a a nude color also but with a little bit more pink to it. So and so far I can say I really like it. They are not super drying like um, some of the other liquid lipsticks I've tried and they are transfer proof and they do last all day so I really really like that I probably have a video with some swatches of these three I may pick up one more you know you can kind of mix your liquid lipsticks to get the look that you want but that's really it for my haul this time like I said if you use the Revlon color stay it is on sale right now at Walgreens 40% off and if you're looking for these don't look in the Milani section look on the little areas where they have all the stuff for special edition right with other products um, because that's where these will be and the, my Walgreens they didn't have a lot of them there was only a few of them out so I don't know if they'll be restocking these or not anyway thanks so much for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And like I said, if you want to see this makeup look, check out the previous video. And like I said, all the products that I've shown you here today were used in this makeup look. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye.